Lady Gabriella Windsor looked chic in a white top hat and a blue patterned dress as she attended the fourth day of Royal Ascot this afternoon. The daughter of the Queen's cousin, Prince Michael of Kent, 41, paired her statement headpiece with a pale pink clutch bag and matching, pointed toe heels. She wore a simple silver bracelet on her wrist, and opted for Loki makeup. Today is the fourth day of the Berkshire horse facing event, and attendees have pulled out all the stops with a colorful array of dresses, over the top headgear, and shimmering jewelry. Lady Gabriella, who attended with her financier husband Thomas Kingston, didnt disappoint in a dazzling blue patterned button down dress, which gathered at the sleeves. Mr. Kingston was also dressed to impress in a grey top hat, pink tie, and fitted tailcoat. In a royal ascot first, male attendees have been told they can remove their ties today as Britain braces itself for the hottest day of the year so far, with temperatures reaching 34 C, 93. 2F. In some parts of the country, men in all enclosures will be allowed to remove their jackets and ties once the traditional royal carriage procession has ended, usually just after 2 p.m. A royal ascot spokesman said, race goers will be expected to arrive compliant but can remove jackets and ties as the day goes on due to the high temperatures. There is precedent for dress code not being enforced for hot weather and one year, visitors were advised to wear boots if they were using the royal enclosure gardens when they were waterlogged. It's rare to relax the dress code but common sense has to apply in extremes of temperature or weather conditions, for everyone's safety and comfort. The Queen has two horses running today but is not expected to attend, amid her ongoing mobility issue. Today's catwalk included monochrome frocks, flashes of fuchsia and floating summer dresses in yellow and greens. Many of those arriving at the main spectator's enclosure opted for coordinating outfits with pals too. Plenty of fans adopted a patriotic theme too, to ensure the Platinum Jubilee celebrations continue, with red, white and blue incorporated into their outfits for the day. Lady Gabriella's appearance at Royal Ascot comes amid reports Prince and Princess Michael of Kent are to retire from public life. This year, Prince Michael, the Queen's first cousin and a fluent Russian speaker with a lineage to Tsar Nicholas II, was forced to sever his ties to Russia after its invasion of Ukraine. He stepped down as patron of the Russo-British Chamber of Commerce, and handed back an Order of Friendship Award, one of Russia's highest honours. Michael, who turns 80 next month, and his wife, Marie Christine, 77, will step down from public life, according to the Daily Telegraph. It is understood the retirement will coincide with the prince's birthday on July 4. According to the official royal family website, Prince Michael is classified as a non-working royal and partakes in more than 200 public engagements for the not-for-profit sector, which are funded by his own household, rather than the taxpayer.